Hello everyone, quick video here to help with a, a question from the community. It's from 2019, but someone brought it up again this week. And it's about selecting one date, a specific day in the filter, and not only that one. They want to select all those prior to that number. For example, if I select the 6th of March, they, will, they want also to include all those before that. Okay. How can we do that? We can use the agger function and a temporary table in the script. I have here a very simple table with product, date, and quantity. And just a tension point here, I have day, month, and year format for the date. And let's create here a temporary table only using the date column. Okay. And we will call this date2. I can clear this other one and it's not related to my prior table. As you can see, it's just a separate column. Let's load this and take a look. Right here, I created a table to show you how they are related. So date two and date, I, I created a very simple table here. So I have, for example, all the, all the current dates for one specific day in day two. And then I have the rest for all of them. So I have all the combinations for day two and date because they are not related. I want to create here a logic to select the 6th of March. And with that, I also select the rest. So I will use the date two with the agger function because when we filter the agger function, it filters the other dimensions in that as well. So I will click here, open a new filter and use the agger. I could be doing, for example, date two and date. This would not fit our conditions, right? So I have to make, if the date is less or equals to date two, bring me the date two. And that's all. After that, I have here the date already, but I also need to include the date two to make a virtual table just like the one I showed you right now with all the combinations. So if I have all the combinations virtually here and now with the selection with this condition, when I select one date two, I will also be selecting those dates that are matching that specific date, okay, with this condition. So I will hit apply. Let me just call this here in the title date two between single quotes and now if i click on the 6th of march my original date will all be filtered with the previous tables with the previous dates as well okay i hope this video helps you somehow and if you like it let me know subscribe to the channel and check out some more videos that we have here okay see you soon bye bye